TED-Ed is an educational platform that offers a wide range of animated videos and interactive lessons on topics like science, literature, and history. It's a great resource for teachers because of its large selection of videos on many different academic topics in English, such as standardized tests, the effect of social media on the brain, or procrastination. The speakers speak naturally with different accents and dialects of English, but they have clear pronunciation, making it ideal for language learners who are working on improving their listening skills. One of the unique features of TED-Ed is that it allows users to create custom lessons based on the TED-Ed videos, so teachers can create listening activities that are tailored to the needs and interests of their students. For example, if you selected this video on superstitions, you will then add your questions, discussion prompts, and additional resources to support students' top-down and bottom-up listening. Then you could share your lesson with your students and start tracking their responses and overall scores on the questions. You can also provide feedback directly on TED -Ed lesson page. When you click Give Feedback, the student is sent an email that contains a link to your feedback, which includes a space provided for them to respond to your feedback. Another tool that I often use in my listening classes is Tandem. It is a free language exchange app that connects users who want to learn a new language with native speakers of that language. It allows users to find language exchange partners based on location, language, and availability. Users are also matched based on their interest in communicating through text, audio, or video chat. Tandem can be used by language teachers to help students improve their listening skills by encouraging them to use the app to find language exchange partners and practice listening to real, authentic speech in a situation where comprehension is critical to interaction. Teachers can create specific assignments for students to learn information from their partner, listening challenges to spend a certain amount of time in conversation, or competitions among students using Tandem. These tasks motivate students to engage in interactive listening while exposing them to the accents and dialects of English users around the world. A free version of Tandem is available for download on the App Store and Google Play, and some additional premium features are available for purchase. Listening to podcasts in English can be a great way to practice listening skills and improve comprehension. Teachers can find podcasts on a wide range of topics, so they can choose ones that align with lesson plans and with students' levels, interests, and goals. One great website with podcasts for language learners is Coffee Break Languages. It has a podcast series that offers lessons in a variety of languages. The series is divided into episodes that cover specific topics and include listening activities and exercises to help listeners improve their skills. Podcasts at Coffee Break Languages use authentic speech of proficient speakers of the languages being taught, which can be a valuable resource for teachers looking to expose their students to different accents and dialects. Coffee Break English, Season 2, Episode 6. Welcome back to Coffee Break English. My name is Mark. And my name is Josie. Welcome. We're delighted to be back with another episode of our podcast, which helps you improve your English. In addition to its listening activities and exercises, Coffee Break Languages also includes accompanying materials, such as transcripts and vocabulary lists to support bottom-up listening. There are several ways to use Coffee Break Languages in the AFL classroom, including assigning specific episodes for homework, using it as a supplement to regular language lessons, encouraging students to listen to it outside of class, and teaching students to recognize different accents and dialects. In the next video, let's look at some more internet resources for listening.